Hi there, my name's Paul. Thank you very much for joining me today. Today I'm pleased to have behind me the Ford Ranger Wild Track, the two litre bi turbo diesel. Uh, pickup truck by Ford, double cab vehicle, absolutely fantastic truck, uh, loads and loads of extra features there with the Wild Track editions as well. Just want to make a quick video and have a quick walk around and show some of those features and the benefits that this fantastic vehicle has got to offer to you. So let's look around. Okay, so this is our Ford Ranger Wild Track in that lovely sea grey colour as well, really nice popular colour as well to go with that. Uh, this vehicle does look absolutely fantastic as you can see we've protected that bodywork on this vehicle by applying a triple layer Gardex treatment that gives you some protection against any negative effects of UV from sunlight, acidity and rainwater, anything at all really that's going to cause premature aging, dimming or deterioration to that lovely finish. Now, first of all, uh, one thing I do wish to point out is this is a new vehicle. So with that, you have got the full manufacturer's warranty, which is a three-year warranty up to 100,000 miles. Uh, and that covers from the date that the vehicle is going to be first registered. Aside from that, you've also got one year's breakdown cover as well, also covered by Ford. And that also starts from the first registration date. Now, as we've said, this is the Wild Track, so you've got lots and lots of bonuses there, extras, features for you with this vehicle. Starting off with, you've got those lovely powerful Xenon headlights that you can see there, lovely LED daytime running lights, you've got the fog lights for added visibility if you're driving in diminished visibility conditions, parking sensors as well, they are on the front and the rear of this vehicle. Moving around the side, you've got those lovely Ford 18-inch alloy wheels as well. Those lovely sidebars running up both sides of this vehicle. As we get to the back of the vehicle, as you can see, you've got the privacy glass on the back there, slightly lightly tinted. Lots and lots of storage room in the loading area of this truck. At the back of the vehicle, parking sensors that you can see there on the back bumper. You've also got the tow bar with the 13-pin power socket as well on there. And you've also got a reversing camera just underneath that Ford badge. Just as we're getting around now, let's just come down the near side of the vehicle. And as you see, you've got your diesel filler just above the near side rear wheel arch. You've got the roof bars on the top as well. So loads and loads going on on the outside. Let's have a look inside. Okay, so moving into the rear seating area, first of all, looking at your door spaces, some storage in there, electronically controlled windows throughout. You've got a lovely semi leather trim there with the hand stitched orange wild track stitching on those door trims. That orange wild track stitching follows all the way through the vehicle as well. So all those leather seats in the back there, you've got that same stitching following throughout. Gives an absolutely beautiful finish to this vehicle. Three adjustable headrests in the back as well. So added convenience there. Pull down armrest with a couple of cup holders in there as well. You've also got Isofix mounting points, so if you do ever have a young one in the back, in a car seat or a booster, you've got a nice industry recognised safety standard there for them. Uh, moving into the centre, you've got a 150 watt 230 power inverter there, and a 12 volt charging point as well. You've also got the floor mats in the back, which also have that orange wild track stitching there just to give that nice finish following all the way through. Now moving into the front of the vehicle, storage in the driver's door and the passenger door on the front as well. All of the electronic windows can be locked and controlled from the driver's console just on the driver's panel there. Electronic central locking as well. Looking in the door trims, you've got those lovely wild track plates there on the door trims as well. The driver's seat, you've got electronically controlled adjustments for that one as well. The seats in the front, you've still got that lovely Wild Track stitching with the embossed Wild Track logo just there. Also, that follows through onto the passenger seat as well. There, follows through onto the skirt of the automatic gear stick, the handbrake, the armrest. And I'm just going to point out from here as well. You've also got lumbar support there with the driver's seat on this vehicle. So let's just step into the into the vehicle. So from the driver's seat, just to the right of the steering wheel, as you can see there, you've got your lighting controls. You've also got automatic headlights 
which is a nice little added feature of the Wild Tracks. You've got electronically controlled mirrors along with having the power fold feature, the button just there on the top. You've also got a keyless ignition system, which is just around there on the other side of the steering wheel. So I've just popped the key into the cup holders in the center there, foot down on the brake. And as you see, the vehicle starts up nice and easy first time on the button. Looking at your steering wheel, loads and loads of connectivity on the steering wheel. So the D-pad on the right there, just going to use that to go through the options there on the right side of the dash display. Lots and lots of options for you to go through, whether it's down to your economy, driver, uh, conveniences there. Lots of settings in there, different displays for you to go through. So lots and lots of functionality for you in there. Just going back again, as well as the speedos, you've also got the TPS system there, the tyre pressure system. Now I'm just going to point out, looking at this dash display while we're here, no warning lights at all, and 53.8, so delivery miles only and nothing else. On the left D-pad, you've got the different media options there, so you've got your entertainment page, navigation option in there and once you've got a phone connected you'll have your different phone options in there as well looking at the rest of your steering wheel controls on the right you've got your cruise control options with the limiter on there media controls volume hands-free cooling and voice controls there on the left looking at the stalks you've got automatic wipers with this vehicle as well on the uh, indicator stalk you've also got the option there for the assisted lane guidance as well Looking at the steering wheel itself, that's also finished off with that lovely hand-stitched orange wild track stitching as well. Just looking into the centre, you've got a few different driving modes there between two and four wheel drive. Automatic gear stick as you can see, which also has the sports mode coming right the way down to the bottom there. Got the option there to turn the sensors on and off you've got the traction control and the assisted hill start as well looking upwards at the climate controls let's just put the vehicle into neutral so it can get the camera just in there so you've got three stage heated front seats as well you've also got aircon included with this vehicle you've got the heated front windscreen as well so loads and loads going on there with the climate controls. Underneath there you've got some storage with a USB input and two 12 volt charging points. Coming up to the media system now, fully touch screen system. You have got the sat nav built into this device as well as you can see there. In the radio options you've got DAB radio included. You've also got the climate control digital screen that can come up onto this page as well phone options so once you've got the phone connected as we said you can stream audio and you've got the hands-free calling options as well you can download apps from Ford Connect and Ford Pass as well just popping into settings and the last things that I want to point out you've got the emergency assistance options when a device is connected but you can also connect a phone to this device using the USB points below and that will also support Apple CarPlay and Android Auto so you can mirror your device onto this uh, screen as well so let's just have one last quick look around as you see you've got those lovely orange stitched floor mats as well wild track logo and stitching across the dash just gives a very very nice finish to this vehicle I'm sure you'd agree absolutely beautiful truck that this is okay so that is the Ford Ranger Wild Track in Seal Grey. Fantastic vehicle, fantastic value for money. Loads and loads of functionality there. You've even got the tow bar to add extra functionality and usability for you. You've got the ability to tow an additional 2.9 tons as well. 2,900 kilos extra that you can tow with this truck. So anything at all we can do to assist with a purchase or discuss one of our fantastic finance deals, please feel free to let us know and it'll be a pleasure to look after you however possible. Aside from that, if you can hit that five star review button for me, that would be greatly appreciated on my part. Once again, thank you very, very much for your time and looking around this vehicle with me today. Have a lovely day ahead and we'll look forward to speaking to you very, very soon. Bye now.